Peace, love, light, and king, noble, black, supremacy. This is a continuance of where I was defining um, God and messiahship um, and being a leader. One thing I did not include in the last video is also how um, there are also people who are self-made, who have created their own businesses. Who have been able to flourish based off of that. So, and I and I feel like I already explained that. I just didn't um, give this. I didn't specifically use the word. Um, well, the words business owner, but that's another way to look at it as well. Being self-established, really utilizing your mind. Um, having that gift of doing so, really getting in touch with your creativity. Because when we are a part of the matrix and we are getting out of the matrix, there's a lot of deprogramming we have to do, but not all of us are affected in the same way that some of us are. Like some of us, it would take like a very long time in order for us to establish that level of creativity because of what we've been taught because we had a sensitivity of uh being programmed easily but not all of us are like that some of us were able to still stand strong and hold on to our creativity and truly uh build something out of it so i just wanted to also add on to that perspective when it comes to um our leaders, our gods, our messiahs stepping into those titles and uh, how they're able to potentially obtain that. Some of them have gone through uh, heavy studying in certain ways and they had to go through a heavy detox of what the matrix had programmed into their uh, subconscious. But some of our lords our gods our messiahs were able to hold on to their minds they weren't as affected as some of us have been in the matrix so i just wanted to um also add that i hope you are enjoying the content make sure you like make sure you subscribe make sure you comment and make sure you share peace love light and king noble black supremacy